<laughs> this, uh, I guess, first of all, to get a win here in, in this environment and to do it the way you did it, I mean, what's going through your mind right now? Uh, a lot of excitement. Uh, this is why I came to the program, help us get wins like this, and uh, we beat a very good team tonight. Uh, not many people come to this hostile environment and get wins, and uh, we were fortunate enough to make some key plays down the stretch, get some defensive stops, and uh, come away with a win. It, was, it seemed to be a real dogged and determined effort. I mean, when the shots weren't falling, you guys were battling, playing defense. Yeah, those guys, uh, their front court guys really battle on the glass, and even their guards are really mm -hmm. athletic can really jump, get up on the glass, and uh, cause havoc. So we just had to put bodies on them and uh, try to control the glass in that standpoint. And uh, we ended up getting some balls at the end and uh, got them out and made some shots. I mean, we were fortunate to come out with a win, and uh, we're going on very happy. Yeah, um, you know, at one point in the second half, you guys, I think, went down five. And that's usually where things tip the other way. And uh, But then you came back with a couple of big buckets. And what did you see on those plays that, to kind of bring you guys back and closer? Oh, well, I, those guys found me in my spots. I got to get a lot of credit to my teammates for uh, finding me when I was open. And I was fortunate enough to make those shots. Uh, those guys, uh, the crowd was really into it at that point in time. And uh, those guys found me, and I was just fortunate, like I said, to make those shots and uh, help us get this win. You know, last year, late in the season, and then in New York, you know, mental toughness has always been kind of a theme. Fran brought it up a couple of times. But to, to be here in North Carolina, <laughs> you know, you're down, hostile environment, and to close it out and, and be, do it in the way you did it. And what does it say about the team and the toughness you guys showed? Uh, like I told uh, Jerry, I don't think we would have got this win last year. Uh, we, were, uh, we weren't we mentally tough as we needed to be last year down the stretch. I think that was pretty obvious. Mm -hmm. And uh, we kind of collectively made uh, an, an attempt this, this year to turn the page on that. And uh, New York, uh, we did a little bit, but we weren't tough enough in New York as well, as you guys saw. And I hope this is a turning point for us to uh, keep the momentum going on the rest of the year and uh, continue to get some wins. What's this like for, for your buddy Mike? I mean, you know he's a compared to Marcus, even though yeah. you guys are all great friends, but that's always going to be there. Right. And to have his performance tonight like this. I think uh, I think it's great for him because he played real well. And uh, throughout AAU, he was always getting prepared to him, mm -hmm. fairly or unfairly. And uh, I think he showed that he's his own player and does his own thing. And uh, he's capable of just the things that Marcus is. And, uh, Marcus is a great player, don't mm -hmm. get me wrong. But uh, I'm happy to play with Mike, and uh, I'm excited we got to win tonight. Was it almost? Uh, I was gonna say, was it almost appropriate that that he closed it out? <laughs> yeah, I mean, uh, to be honest, I didn't care who closed it out. <laughs> Someone who closed his damn win out. That's that's all that really mattered. But that and one that he shot and made, that was that was huge. And then those, that first free throw, I looked up and I was just praying that 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 come down for us. And then he did. And then uh, the second one was just icing on the cake. Yeah. And. Uh, I think he saw he uh, he got it going early, which really helps him out a lot and opens up our our offense. We didn't make a lot of shots tonight. I don't yeah. know if you guys noticed. Or yeah. Not, but, uh, <laughs> those shots that he made and the shots that Gabe made and Whitey's free throws and Jared played real well on the glass. He couldn't buy a bucket at sometimes, but uh, yeah. he's continued to stick with it. And uh, we had a lot of guys who played real well. Sappy hit a couple of big shots for us, and uh, yeah. I think collectively that was a big time win for us. You mentioned collectively you didn't shoot the ball well from the floor, but how big was the free throw shooting? Twenty one and twenty four. Right, and I had one of those misses but I was still kicking myself about. And I think Jared Matt had one or two misses, and he done missed many coming from last year. And uh, Whitey was huge. I think he was 10 for 10 or something like that. And uh, free throws can win or lose your games. And uh, if we didn't shoot well from the free throw line tonight, we would have definitely lost this game. Uh, we haven't shut the ball real well this season so far from the field. And uh, our defense has kept us in it most of the time. And uh, New York, it kind of let, we let us win the defensive end. So I think this is a big win that we kept our defense together and uh, got key stops when we needed them. Anything special winning here for you? And you know, I know the history of this building and what this program is all about. You have to just look in, look in the gym and look at all the banners and all the history that they've had. And I didn't get a chance to check out the Hall of Fame or whatever around here, but uh, some of the coaches did. And it's pretty impressive, all the All-Americans and national titles they've had. And uh, I mean, Coach Williams is, is a hell of a coach. There's no doubt about it. I got a lot of respect for the man and uh, everything he's about. And so to come here and get a big time win with all the people that said I shouldn't have gone to Iowa, I should have came here, and uh, I think it kind of shows why I did come here and uh, why we play this game so hard. Were you trying to maybe, I don't want to say you don't try.